Hi guys, it's Mary Mary. Sorry you've seen so much of me this week, but I think you want to see this haul of epic proportions. Okay, um, I had a garage sale today. I met a transvestite. <laughs> He's coming back over tomorrow <laughs> to, <laughs> to look at the rest of my wardrobe. He gave me a hug and he told me I had nice tits. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> All right. So of course, um Meatball's away at his cottage. He'll be back shortly, whatever. And I had a bizarre chat with his wife, and then she's crying, Junior screaming, and it's all because she went from one carrier to another and she could be called, but she can't call out. So I had my pants falling off my butt, shoe dangling in this room. It's the room that actually looks out into my living room and kitchen trying to get their phones straightened. They are just... It was horrible. She's so upset. She's like threatening to just end it all. Um, and it's hard to take one phone out of a jack, put it into the modem and do this and get on the Wi-Fi. They were trying to get on using probably my Wi-Fi. Um, just a mess. I can't even go into the conversations. How can you expect to get a phone up and running if you have the son and the mom yelling at each other? It's like, and then do you think yelling at your provider is going to help? They have a, no, no, it's not going to help. <laughs> Needless to say, her phone's all working. And I said, no more. I don't know you anymore. If I see Frank, if Frank goes ballistic because, you know, if something else goes wrong with the phones or whatever, I said, there'll be consequences. And this time I'm going to bank his photos off my garage if anything occurs because of my, you know, a good deed never goes unpunished, you guys. So anyways, um, I had the garage sale. I'm going to have it for maybe till I don't know noon tomorrow and, and and I'm done with it I don't like garage sales the tax write-offs are better easier whatever but I I am looking forward to the cash I could tell you that when you put down your lotion in frustration look at this that it is so good when it gets in your eye it doesn't sting so I love this love this lotion so let's go on to the haul okay because of mrs kong's mom i went here and because i still have probably 10 antibacterial soaps because i'm leery of using them for we don't know kelly do we know yet other kelly do we know yet do we know why we don't use antibacterial soaps anymore what i did like are the hair products there though so i have morocco orchard and pink amber shimmer fizz body mousse that's great i thought this was mousse for my hair so now i have body mousse so i can shimmer which by the way the transvestite his favorite look is like he said 60 year old and slutty <laughs> oh that's terrific it's such a shame too because when he reached over he bought um an antique of mine when he reached over, I saw the, low, the Rolex on his wrist, and I'm like, mm, my girlfriend Linda, she's got some crazy boyfriends. This would be a good one until, you know, I, I heard the rest of the story. So I apparently have body mousse shimmer fizz. This is in Tokyo, Lotus, and Apple Blossom. I don't know what this smells like. I thought it was mousse for my hair. It just smells like the usual bath and body. It's not bad. Not bad at all. So that's wonderful. I don't know how much those were. 
Let's see. <clears throat> you get this free shipping. I'll freeze that for you. I spent $7.60 at Bath and Body Works. And all the little shoppers today, they love the little cute bags to take home. So that's fun. We got this cute thing. So that's good. Here's a coupon you'll get. And I had that buy 40, get $10 off, but there's no way I need any more Bath and Body Works stuff. None. All right. Then I went to Yankee Candle, which I've never gone to. I'd rather just spend less money at Bath and Body Works. So I went to Yankee Candle, and I spent $5.75 on two big candles, and these were $0.50. Cents. This is in Lavender Vanilla which I like. This is Fluffy Towels, 50 cents right now at Yankee Candles. And this one I really loved, Banana Nut Bread. Okay, so those are 50 cents each. And then I have two candles, which I could really use some aromatherapy right now. Uh, Pure Radiance Yankee Candle and Pumpkin. So this baby pumpkin is going to do this baby pumpkin. It's a weird wick. I'll show you it in the next one. Right, puppies? They're hiding right now. And you get a coupon. And then there was a battle of the restaurants, and they have walking tacos, taco in a bag gourmet tacos at the mall. And they had a um, market, like, um, you know, like, you know, a vegetable market, a farmer's stand, but it was my kind of farmer's stand because it had a lot of fun stuff there, and I'll show you that too. So this is Pure Radiance in Ember Light. So I like that. So that was good. I spent $11.70 there. And then because of Pebbles Flintstone, or Pebbles, Pebbles Flintstone, yeah, Maria. Okay, blame her for this. Okay. It comes nicely wrapped. So I got the Victoria's Secret. I think this was $8. It is the opening. Whoops. Oh, you guys, I'm sorry about that. Here we go. <laughs> All right, it's in the Illuminating Face Powder. It looks like this. They are discontinuing their makeup line and focusing on scents. So this is cute. I'm going to pop it out and put it in a frame. 